Dennis Olin collapsed into a chair, sobbing uncontrollably as a jury in New Brunswick found him guilty of second-degree murder in the death of his father, prominent businessman Richard Oland. Olin began crying and wailing, oh my God, after the verdict in St. John. Family members cried and hugged each other. None commented as they left the court, but in a statement from Olin's mother, Connie, she says the family is shocked and saddened. She says they will discuss their legal options. A statement from Olin's uncle, Derek, also maintained his innocence. Defense lawyers Gary Miller and Alan Gold declined comment as they left the courthouse, while Crown Prosecutor P.J. Vigneault made a brief statement. We thank all the jurors for their careful and complete consideration of all of the evidence placed before them. They have completed their duty as the law requires and as explained to them by Mr. Justice Walsh. We will be making no additional comments at this time with regards to the outcome of the trial. The body of Richard Olin was found face down in a pool of blood in a St. John office in July 2011. The key piece of evidence for the Crown was a brown jacket worn by Dennis Oland that had a number of small blood stains and DNA that matched the profile of Richard Oland. A sentencing hearing is set for February. From the Canadian Press, I'm Kevin Bissett.